Okay, so when I went to the mailbox today, there was uh, no box, but it said the box was here, so I was scared. Then I realized the mail got switched. Uh, of all days, I got my neighbor's mail, and my neighbor got my mail. So I went over there, <laughs> and thank God the box was there. Um, this is the Jason Fry. 1,000 giveaway winner box right here. Actually, part one, because he couldn't fit it all in box one. Um, <laughs> says box two will be here next week on hard. Um, I'm a little bit nervous to even open this box. I'm not a box guy. I don't even have a thing to open it with. Um, kind of shocked that I even won. I don't have that much luck, actually. I wish I had that kind of luck in the casinos around here in Vegas, but I don't. And um, I actually won three giveaways in one week. It first was uh, Diecast Hero, and then I won um, Dick Grayson's giveaway, and then the uh, for the finale, Jason Fry 1000 Mega Box over here. It's so heavy. I am literally I'm getting anxiety about it. I almost don't even want to open it. I'm afraid. I actually bought this display case because I plan to crack some of these and um, hang them up right in my office. Um, you know, it was important to Jason to uh, not have this box go to a scalper. And uh, he doesn't want to see all these cars he hunted down going on eBay. And I'll tell you, I don't do eBay. Haven't done any transactions yet. A few years ago, I sold some coins on eBay, but that was it. Um, so these cars are staying in my collection. Um, they're probably, this box alone is probably better than my entire collection I have right now. If you saw one of my earlier videos, I lost pretty much all the cars I had as a kid, and I wanted to give them to my son, and I couldn't. So, um, winning all these giveaways and just being a part of this community with all the RAOK -okay boxes and trades and everything has just been kind of overwhelming. It's an awesome thing that I didn't expect to, to have when I did this. So, um, let's open this up and see what's in it. I'll show you guys what's in it from Jason Fry on hard. or anything. I don't carry weapons. And then I thought this might happen. My, my son's already looking to get in here. And uh, Frank, you're going to have to wait on this one. There's some stuff in here you can't have. I was afraid my son might attack. I gave him, um, I gave him the, uh, oh no, don't go in there, no, no, don't, don't go in there. Yeah, there's caught, there's what in there? I, I gave him a, a Millennium Falcon to try to distract him, but, uh, he sees the cars are in there. Oh no, don't do that. Don't do that. Tow trucks. No, 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 no tow trucks. No, no. No, 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 I gotta read the note first. No, 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 no. No. Ah. No. <laughs> That's a fake cry. <laughs> All right, let's go. With, where's the note? What'd you do with the note? Okay. Frank, congrats. I was very happy to see you won my contest. I'm sure you will give every car a good home. There is a red double-decker bus 
it's loose. This car is very special to me. It may be the best example of this car known. I hope you loved it. Jason. Okay, so far Frank hasn't been able to get at anything yet. So. I don't know where to start. <laughs> okay, uh, well Frank just pulled this out. Batman, pop culture. So I guess we'll start with that because it looks like there's more of them in here. Taxi cab. Taxi cab, yeah. Oh, a matchbox taxi cab. Look at that. Checkered, yellow checkered taxi. More matchbox. Police car. What's that? More matchbox police. We love those. The rest of the Batman cars. Dad. Oh my gosh, the whole set. Look at that. <laughs> if you saw how deep this one runs, <laughs> how deep this box goes. Okay. Got it. <laughs> oh my god. That is awesome. The Batman pop culture is the only pop culture set I would want anyway. These Matchbox are awesome too. All the good ones. Look at that. That's a vintage red line. The vintage series there, a 32 Ford Vicky. There's some loose cars all scattered throughout in here, which they're looking really awesome to me. Oh, what did you just pull out of there? White Lightning. That's a Chase Johnny Lightning, White Lightning. Slot car, awesome. Wait, Frank, wait your turn. Here, we'll take out uh, uh, we'll take out some loose ones. Car. Car racing. Car, Dada. This one's awesome. This is an old Car. 19... What is this? 1970... So it doesn't even have the date on it. Leslie, made Horse in England. Car. Horse box. Love this. Yeah. Oh, I love this so much. This is one of the best old ones to have, in my opinion. Alright, you gotta control yourself. You gotta control yourself. Okay. Alright. Okay. Your spaceship, I'll get you your spaceship. Taxi cab. And I'll get you the taxi cab. Had some technical difficulties, as usual. So back to the box. <laughs> Another white lightning. Look at that. This is one of the dragsters. The few legends. What I love about this right here. I don't know, can you see it good? The wheel pants on the front, look at that. The white lightning, Keeling and Clayton. Awesome, I love how it says white lightning on the tires. This is just something I probably would never have gotten. <laughs> All of these cars. 
Uh, <laughs> I can't even believe it already, and I haven't even made a dent in this. Um, we got here <laughs> the Super 8 Crate Treasure Hunt. If you saw my other video, I had a total fail on this crate, this 8 crate. I worked so hard to try to get the dump in for this one and I didn't. Our local scalper got everything. <laughs> oh my gosh, the loose cars in here are just will blow you away. <laughs> Look at that Corvette. Beautiful. Rubber tires. Some amazing Lucy's in here. Here's another Hot Wheels loose one. That one puts rescue duty to shame. It's like a backwards bomb in the front there, right? Look at that. Beautiful. And these are all beautiful cars. Metal on metal. Oh, a refuse truck, garbage truck. And these old garbage trucks, they used to make them little, like the actual real garbage trucks were smaller than the ones we see now. Look at the moving parts. I am just loving these Lucy's. <laughs> I know that I am just so lucky to get this right now. And I mean, you know, after what I lost, some of these Lucy's just mean like the world to me already. I just, just to be able to have these and add to the ones that I had, I, I, I'm, I'm just grateful for that. With the bikes in the back, shout out to the mad biker. More Lucy's. Get that beautiful T-Bird. This is too much. <laughs> Classic Nomad Hot Wheels Collectors Convention Los Angeles. <sighs> awesome. Look at this awesome Chevy Nomad. This is like the original two-door uh, mini SUV here. Look at that though, huh? Oh my gosh. Jason, man, this is too much. If you guys only saw all this, these cars in here, man. Lamborghini. I, I had to uh, make some space on the memory card so I can fit more video and finish up this video, which is part one of the Jason Fry giveaway. 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Mega crazy mega hero box over here. So, let me get back into it here. I was showing you the uh, Lamborghini, right? Um, more Lucy's. Funny car. I'm loving the pink and blue. Loving that. Cali Custom. 1977 on there. Beautiful, beautiful. We got a M2 Chase. And this, I just found my first M2 Chase, but this one just blows it out of the water. Oh my gosh, a limo Chase. Look at that fins. The 57 Chevy fins. And then the in, inner interior detail with all the roll cage in there and everything. And then the inside, whatever that is, a blown engine inside the limo. That's just crazy. <laughs> this is now my best M2 chase piece. And so much for, <laughs> so much for putting everything in this case here. <laughs> I don't think it'll fit. <laughs> Here's another thing that won't fit in the case. <laughs> Look at this thing. The Volkswagen Chase Hauler. 
limited to 1,600 pieces. Think small. Not like this box. <laughs> I love it. I love it, Jason. Thank you, man. Another one that won't fit in that case I bought. <laughs> okay. What is this? Another M2 Chase. Look at that. The Firebird Sprint 1968. Look at that with the green on green. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stuff. These are all like now instantly the best cars in my collection. Oh gosh. This fire truck made in England. The refinery fire department. Wow. Wow. Standard Oil Company. If you guys paid attention in social studies class, you should know about Standard Oil. Beautiful, I love this. <laughs> More awesome. Oh my gosh, more awesome Lucy's that I just love this. Look at this. Black and yellow. Black and yellow. Hot Rod. Plymouth Roadrunner. 71. Look at that thing. I love this. I'm loving the black and yellow. Black and yellow. Actually, the car I drive is all yellow. Another beautiful Lucy. We got the good humor truck. And I don't know what that pizza wings ice cream truck is that they have in the 2015 mainline, but this is the way it should be right here. Good humor. Beautiful. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I said the box went deep. Look at this. Green light. I mean, Jason covered everything. I got... You know, one of my goals was to try to have a chase in every brand. Just one in every brand. And I mean, just in this box alone, I think he covered it all. Look at these awesome Volkswagens. You got the uh, Samba bus, another Samba bus, two Beatles, and the, the Volkswagen panel van there. This is beautiful. Green light, green machine. I love it. Oh my gosh. One, two, three, four, five green machines in one. <laughs> and then this Jason left the note about <sighs> the news of the world London transport look at that look how, how thin it is I know what he was saying now you're, you're saying like how it's perfect to scale out the transport trolley thing here was thinner than a normal car it's got the news of the world. That's a, a newspaper in, in London. It's a very popular newspaper. And then it eventually became like one of the first like tabloid type papers. It would always tell about like sensationalist stories. Pretty cool piece. For me as a social studies teacher, this is like probably the best thing I have in my collection right here. Look at this. Look at the little stairway going up to the second floor. I'll probably have to bring this into my class for show and tell. <laughs> Look at these metal wheels. Metal, like, trolley wheels. <laughs> all, you, all you had to do was put this one in here and you could have just blew me away with this. This is the best. Look at that by Lesney Toys. This was when it was good. You, you could just feel, it's not just that it's metal, it's such highly detailed, fine work. You know, just quality. I mean, you can drop this out of a building and it wouldn't fall apart. <laughs> Unbelievable box of awesomeness. And still more to come, and I can't even believe that. Jason, you overwhelm me with this stuff. I can't even, I don't know where to begin to thank you. Um, your channel is so awesome. Your giveaway is the best. Uh, it's like, um, you know, I, I watch your videos just to help me find treasure hunt. So honestly, 
I wouldn't even be finding the treasure hunts that I found for myself. And now you go and get me this box that just totally just overwhelms me and blows me away. Um, I kind of felt bad to enter the contest and, you know, beat out some kid, you know. But um, I know most of the guys entering the contest weren't kids. And, um, you know, this is partly for my kids, too. I'm doing this for them. So a lot of this um, I'm going to save for them. And I'm going to be displaying this up for me, you know. This is a, a big moment for me you know collecting and in three or four months now I've been collecting to just get a box like this is that just totally overwhelms the collection I already have is kind of amazing to me because um, I think I could collect for years and I would never never get these pieces um, you know the, the kindness that everyone's been showing on YouTube, it, it's a humbling experience for me, and uh, um, I just can't get over how, you know, I could have family and friends who wouldn't do this for me. Um, I'm, in fact, it was family who took my cars to begin with, and then to think that a guy like Jason will just come along and throw a box like this together and give it away to a random person is just amazing. Uh, I could only imagine what Jason you have in your collection to be able to give these away to me. Uh, but I realize you gave me some pieces that, you know, really meant a lot to you. And I think that's what it's about is being able to see a piece go into someone else's collection and mean a lot to them. Maybe more to them than it did to you. Um, these pieces are going right up. These are like the flagship pieces of my collection. Okay, I am going to do another video where I crack all these and display them nice. As you can see, that was a crazy mega box of awesomeness that no one person really deserves. I don't deserve it. Nobody deserves that. That, that basically made my whole collecting life right there um i'll never get cars like that and i shouldn't i can't believe there's another part of that box coming that just shows you what a great guy jason is very uh generous nice guy you know watch all his videos check out the early videos where he shows you how to find the treasure hunts um you know, in, you know, in-store videos were there, but then Jason takes it and takes it to another level and makes it in-store madness. It's definitely a movement. I got the in-store madness. I'm getting out there. Be out there hunting the treasure hunts. Be on the front lines before those cars get off to eBay and you wind up having to order them up and pay full price. Um, Jason inspires me to hunt hard. Just a great guy, and a huge thank you, shout out to Zane. Thank you, 164, brother. I appreciate that, and um, I'll have something special for you, Zane, when I send out a box to Jason. Thank you both. Thank you, guys. Keep it up. You're awesome. Hunt hard. Ah.